1491, Nicholas Copernicus enrolled along with his brother André at the University in Krakow, one of Europe's oldest and most renowned. At that time, astronomy and mathematics were extremely popular, and the university, later known as Jagiellonian University, was internationally recognised in these fields. As we can see, Copernicus paid his admission fees in full, but his brother didn't, and the debt is still noted in the university books. Copernicus valued his studies in Krakow, and later on, in his famous work on the revolutions of the celestial spheres, he wrote that all he achieved in the field of astronomy was due to his studies here. The instruments we can see were left to the university by Professor Marcin Belitsa, who was a student and later professor here in the mid-15th century, and later an astrologer to the King of Hungary and then Poland. The globes and astronomical instruments were definitely seen and most likely used by Copernicus. To celebrate Copernicus's 500th birthday, American astronaut Neil Armstrong donated this photo of the Earth taken from the Moon during his Apollo 2 mission. There is also one of the university's greatest treasures connected to Copernicus, a handwritten manuscript of his writings which the university has only had since the 1960s. We exchanged it with the Czechs for several handwritten works by Jan Amos Kamensky, a well-known Czech pedagogue, and in return, they gave us the Copernicus manuscripts.